Welcome to how to solve this radical equation square root of 7 to the power square root of m minus square root of 3 to the power square root of m is equal to 40. We can write this uh, square root of 7 as 7 to the power 1 over 2 whole to the power this power square root of m minus you can write this uh, square root of 3 as 3 to the power 1 over 2 whole to the power this power square root of m is equal to 40. Next according to property of exponents a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power m times n. This power 1 over 2 will be multiplied by this power square root of m 7 to the power 1 over 2 times square root of m square root of m over 2 minus 3 to the power 1 over 2 times the square root of m square root of m over 2 is equal to 40. Now, here we have a square root of m over 2 and here we have a square root of m over 2. So, we suppose that let square root of m over 2 is equal to x and we substitute uh, this value in this equation then this equation becomes 7 to the power x minus 3 to the power x is equal to 40. Next uh, this is 7 to the power x 7 to the power x has power 1 here minus and this 3 to the power x 3 to the power x also has power 1 here is equal to 40 and 1 is equal to 1 over 2 times 2. So, we replace uh, this one and this one with this 1 over 2 times 2 7 to the power x whole to the power we replace this one with this uh, 1 over 2 times 2. 1 over 2 times 2 minus 3 to the power x whole to the power we replace this one with this 1 over 2 times 2 1 over 2 times 2 is equal to 40. Next according to the rule of exponents a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power m times n we multiply this power x with this 1 over 2 and this power x with this 1 over 2 7 to the power x times 1 over 2 x over 2 whole to the power this power 2 minus 3 to the power x times 1 over 2 x over 2 whole to the power this power 2 is equal to 40. Next we suppose that uh, this uh, 7 to the power x over 2 is equal to a and this uh, 3 to the power x over 2 is equal to b. Let 7 to the power x over 2 is equal to a and 3 to the power x over 2 is equal to b and we substitute uh, these values in this equation then this equation becomes a square minus b square is equal to 40. Next we factorize both sides a square minus b square is equal to a plus b times a minus b is equal to and this 40 can be factorized as 40 times 1, 20 times 2, 10 times 4, 8 times 5, 5 times 8, 4 times 10, 2 times 20 and 1 times 40. And from here a square minus b square is equal to a positive number. 
it means this number a square is greater than this number b square a square is greater than b square and a is greater than b then this number a plus b will be greater than this number a minus b a plus b is greater than a minus b so from here we have four cases where first factor is greater than the second here 40 is greater than 1 20 is greater than 2 10 is greater than 4 and 8 is greater than 5 so these four cases will be rejected now in first case 40 times 1 if we add 40 plus 1 is equal to 41 and 41 divided by 2 cannot be written as a power of 7 or as a power of 3 if we add these two factors 20 plus 2 is equal to 22 and 22 divided by 2 is equal to 11 this number 11 cannot be written as a power of 7 or as a power of 3 now we check this third case 10 times 4 if we add 10 and 4 is equal to 14 and 14 divided by 2 is equal to 7 7 can be written as a power of 7 7 to the power 1 so we select this case 10 times 4 and we check this case also 8 times 5 if we add 8 plus 5 is equal to 13 divided by 2 13 divided by 2 cannot be written as a power of 7 and as a power of 3 so no integer solutions can be found from this case so we reject these three cases 8 times 5 20 times 2 and 40 times 1 so this is the only case for which we can find integer solutions 10 times 4 we factorize this 40 as 10 times 4 and we write this greater factor a plus b equal to this greater factor 10 and we write this smaller factor a minus b equal to this smaller factor 4 a plus b is equal to 10 and a minus b is equal to 4 and we add these two equations 1a plus 1a 2a and this positive b will be cancelled with this negative b is equal to 10 plus 4 14 and we divide both sides by 2 this 2 will be cancelled with this 2 and we get the value of a 14 divided by 2 7 and we put this value of a in this equation value of a 7 plus b is equal to 10 we move this 7 to the right side b is equal to 10 minus 7 and b is equal to 3 so the value of a is 7 and value of b is 3 now recall that we have supposed we have supposed that 7 to the power x over 2 is equal to a and 3 to the power x over 2 is equal to b we have supposed 7 to the power x over 2 is equal to a and 3 to the power x over 2 is equal to b now first we put the value of a 7 in this equation 7 to the power x over 2 is equal to value of a 7 and this 7 has power 1 here now base is same at both sides so this 7 will be cancelled with this 7 and x over 2 is equal to 1 and if we multiply both sides by 2 we get the value of x 2 now in this equation we put the value of b 3 3 to the power x over 2 is equal to value of b is 3 and this 3 has power 1 here and base is same at both sides so this 3 will be cancelled with this 3 and x over 2 is equal to 1 and if we multiply both sides by 2 we get the value of x 2 
so from here in each case the value of x is 2 now recall that we have supposed we have supposed square root of m over 2 is equal to x we have supposed square root of m over 2 is equal to x in this equation we put the value of x 2 square root of m over 2 is equal to value of x 2 and we multiply both sides by 2 this 2 will be cancelled with this 2 and square root of m is equal to 2 times 2 4 and we take a square of both sides this square will be cancelled with this square root and we get the value of m is equal to square of 4 is 16 so this is the final answer value of m 16 now to verify this value of m we put this value in the original equation the original equation is square root of 7 to the power square root of m minus square root of 3 to the power square root of m is equal to 40 in this equation we put the value of m 16 we can write this uh, square root of 7 as 7 to the power 1 over 2 whole to the power square root of uh, we replace this m with 16 minus we can write this square root of 3 as 3 to the power 1 over 2 whole to the power we replace this m with 16 square root of 16 is equal to 40 7 to the power 1 over 2 times square root of 16 is 4 minus 3 to the power 1 over 2 times square root of 16 is 4 is equal to 40 from here 2 1 time and 2 2 times 4 and from here 2 1 time 2 2 times 4 so here we left 7 square minus 3 square is equal to 40 7 square is 49 minus 3 square is 9 is equal to 40 and 49 minus 40 is 40 is equal to 40 from here you can see that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side so it is proved that the value of m 16 is correct